What is the influence of sex on athletic performance? Do we have any data to support the widely accepted practice to ban athletes from any sexual activities during major events like a soccer World Cup? As it so happened, Team Germany was about to put themselves out of contention by losing the first match against Japan. November 27th, the team from Spain was the next opponent and this game would probably decide the fate of the Germans. With Spain dominating the international scene for quite a while now and a German team that hardly managed to defeat the team from Oman just days before the World Cup, the odds for losing were tremendous for the Germans. The very day before the match, two very interesting messages made the headlines. One of the largest German newspapers went out with the news that the players' partners were allowed to stay overnight in the team hotel. Two nights of love, now we want to see goals. The interesting question was, is this reasonable? Because it is more or less generally accepted that sex is detrimental to any athletic performance. The idea goes back to ancient times, to antique Rome and Greece. They believed that abstinence was the best method to ensure athletic performance by keeping body and soul in harmony. The resulting sexual frustration was and still is believed to increase the aggression necessary for high performance in sports. Furthermore, it is believed that ejaculation draws away testosterone from the body, which will result in reduced strength. So could this be the right strategy to beat Spain? Luckily, that same day, Spanish national coach Luis Enrique announced a similar strategy for his team. As long as they didn't attend an orgy, sex before the match was okay, he said. I think the article in the British Mirror is quite remarkable as they chose the wording Luis Enrique insists sex is normal and that he revealed his surprising stance. This clearly reflects an attitude deeply rooted in antique doctrine. But what data has been published to support either view? Well, frankly, there isn't much, but a review from 2016 gathered all available studies to sum up what we know today. Overall, there were only nine studies of acceptable scientific quality out of 143 identified by literature search. In conclusion, none of these studies supports the belief that sex has any negative effect on physical performance, but maybe with one exception. A very small treadmill study on 11 sedentary men came to the conclusion that sex two hours or less before competition may have a negative effect on physical performance. However, once again, this is a very small sample in non-athletes, so it has to be interpreted carefully. Besides, I don't think that there are many elite athletes who engage in sexual activity immediately before they are going to compete. Just for you to know, energy expenditure during sex is not a big deal. We are talking about 25 calories per intercourse on average. Otherwise, sex may help in competition because it has a relaxing effect and reduces stress. It does not have an effect on testosterone levels, neither on short nor long term. There are some studies which came to opposite results, but overall there is no convincing evidence for effects on testosterone. So finally, Spain played Germany 1-1. Both teams had the opportunity for sex the night before. Just theoretically, would the score have been different if they hadn't? I leave it up to you. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.